Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel TN Art. Today I will be sharing with you this decoupage technique on jasmineite. So let's start. Here I have 100 grams of liquid and 250 grams of powder. And I'm mixing both of them. So make sure you need to mix, the, mix it very properly. And to which I'm adding this golden acrylic color in the shade teal. These acrylic paints are by far my favorite. So I'm adding according to my desired color what I need. Uh, I am here. I am adding this copper acrylic paint by Pebio. And this is the mold I'm using. Make sure to clean your mold. So I'm creating a marbling effect here. So I'm adding the copper paint into the jasmineite mixture and just gently doing the swirl. That's it. And now in a swirly motion, I will be adding it to the trinket dish. Trinket dish mold. Make sure to do the tapping as well to release the air bubbles. And after 25 minutes, I have uh, checked and it's hardened and now I'm demolding it. I really can see the swirls and it looks beautiful already. So this is the effect and it's really pretty. I would have left it, but I had to do something else. And these were the leftover. I added a bit more pigment to the jasmineite. So I made these two small coasters to go with the dish. And this is the rice paper that I will be using for the decoupage. And I went with the Alice in the Wonderland theme. But can be much more magical than this. So before, these are the clocks. I really like to work with old effect techniques and this is really amazing to work with these rice papers are so forgiving i have used these in resin as well i will link the video in the description so you can check so i'm using mod podge here and a layer of mod podge into onto the jasmineite coaster first and then i will lay the rice paper on top of it And then a uh, clear coat with the Mod Podge on top of the rice paper. And similarly, I will do the Alice as well. To the Alice as well, I cut it out of according to the size I need for the dish. I thin down a bit of Mod Podge here. So from here, it's all about what you like to add and but where do you want to place your rice paper and it's just what you like.
really wanted to incorporate the words so I selected this side and it looks wonderful rice paper is so for forgiving that you can add wherever you like and it just merge with the base so I really like using rice paper in my creations And now on to my favorite part, the gilding glue. So what I'm doing here is I am just using here according to my mood where I want the gold foil to be. So it's really up to you where you like to add them. And then we let, let it to dry and this has been dried and now these are the gold foils that I will be using I'm just adding little here and there, not overpowering it with the gold foil.
and one final step is sealing it with the stone and concrete wax and I am using my hand and gently rubbing it onto the trinket dish and the coasters and after that I will be using a soft cloth and will buff it up I really love the marbling on the back And with this we are done. This was really a fun project and I really enjoyed making it and I hope you like it as well and if you did please do comment and let me know and also please do like subscribe and share and your valuable comments are always so useful for me and I always learn from them. You guys sometimes give me some amazing tips and I, I try, will try to use them as well. I will stop talking now and please enjoy the rest of the video and thank you so much. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>